Hey everyone, Jason back here with episode 76, I believe it's 76, of Jason Reviews. Tonight, you'll be watching me review the 2014 Kevin Harvick Budweiser Aluminum Bottle Scheme. It's a really great looking die cast, so let's go over the box so we can hurry up and get to the car. Top of the box, we have Kevin Harvick, got his profile with the Chevrolet SS silhouette in the background of the box there. Number 4, 124 scale stock car, limited edition adult collectible, and Lionel Racing, the official die cast of NASCAR. Moving on to the side of the box, we have the NASCAR hologram, the Golden Ticket logo, Stuart Haas Racing, artist rendering of the car, Harvick's profile image once again, Action Racing Collectible, still the choice of champions. And the box features 2014, part of the Platinum Series line, of course. Silver tag that says, Kevin Harvick, number four, Budweiser, aluminum bottle, 2014, SS, one of 805, produced, minus 607. Side of the box, not too much different, except it has the rear bumper cover or TV panel of the SS. This side of the box features the artist rendering sticker once again. Alright, move that to the background. And here's the car. It's a really sharp looking die cast. Painted to look like what the Budweiser aluminum bottles look like in stores now. It's got a really nice artwork all over the car. It's probably one of the better looking Harbor cars I've seen in a while, honestly in my opinion. Should look nice with a red sharpie or paint pen autograph on the front windshield. Alright, so starting off on the front, we have the Chevy Bowtie, Chevrolet SS, the number 4, and Stuart Haas Racing. On the deck lid, we have Budweiser, King of Beers. And some more information, brewed by our original process from the Choices, Hops, Rice, Best Barley, Amizer Bush, Amizer Bush, St. Louis, Missouri. We got Harvick and the Chevy bow ties up on the name banner up on the front windshield. Hood, of course, does open up. There's the engine detail in it. Inside, underneath the hood, we have Chevrolet bow tie, Mobile One, Haas, Jimmy John's, and Budweiser. Moving on to sponsors. We have Moog, Molly, Comp Cam, and Sunoco on the front bumper. Got Goodyear both front tires in yellow, of course. Moving along to the side of the car, we have NASCAR race car up here on the A-pillar, NASCAR Sprint Cup Series, Automator, Jags, Lincoln Motor, Edelbrock Flowmaster, k and Duralast Batteries, Freescale Mobile One, Mechanicware, Holly FI, 3M, and this simulated Chevrolet SS grill vent thing on the door. Got the number four with the little red arrow pointing where the jack goes. We got Kevin Harvick, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram above the door. Two race win stickers. Got Bass Pro, Mobile One, Outback, Hunt Brother Pizza, and Boy Bad Boy Buggies right here on the B pillar. Up on the roof, we have the black bubble cam, number four, functioning roof flaps. And we have Jimmy John's right there as the roof sponsor. We have Budweiser, Exalted, Bosch, behind the number four there, Budweiser, King of Beers. We have the Amizer Bush logo, Mac Tools, Mo One, Haas, Jimmy Johns, and American Ethanol on the quarter panel. Moving on to the rear bumper cover, we have Budweiser, King of Beers, SS, the number four. I think the Kevin Harvick Foundation logo right there. SS up here. Got the extended rear spoiler like they did in 2014. And the red fuel cell inside. Passenger side of the car is pretty much identical to the driver's side except it doesn't have the passenger side window. This car was raced on a short track. So they do not put the passenger side windows on the die cast on short tracks and road course cars. We have the exhaust tips for the on that side of the car. 
like I said, it's pretty much exactly the same. Bottom of the car. It's a really nice looking die cast. I do highly recommend it. I don't see too many of them pop up very often. So if you have a chance to pick this die cast up, I highly recommend it. Alright, below this video you'll see the subscribe, subscribe button. Be sure to click that subscribe button so you never miss out on another future diecast review. I'm on Facebook. I got two Facebook pages, JDR Diecast Reviews and Jason A. Strain Diecast Photography at Jason Aaron Strain on Facebook. I'm also on Twitter and Instagram at Jason A. Strain and Snapchat Dirt Driver 10. Thanks for watching. See you in the next review, episode 77. Take care. Goodbye.